am Jess. So I went to a program at my library the other week on gardens and I left thinking I need to know more about compost as you do. And so I started looking and browsing and I found this book and it's called Composting for a New Generation and it's by Michelle Balls. And okay, I did not think <laughs> a book about compost could be this interesting and yet and yet it is. Um, one of the things I truly loved about this book is that Michelle is clearly someone who loves compost. She just loves it. Um, she starts off in her introduction and she says that she cannot imagine life without compost. <laughs> and listen, that is the kind of person I want to write a book about compost, right? Someone who just like loves this thing. Um, big fan of when people are passionate about things, just big fan of that. And I like that her enthusiasm definitely carries over into her writing. This is a very entertaining book. And again, I know we're talking about compost. So the fact that she made me want to read the whole thing, that says a lot, right? So this is a really good nonfiction book. And what I like is that it is well laid out. It is easy to follow. There are um, illustrations and pictures and there's lots of answers. And I think it's one of those that you can um, absolutely read straight through. And I did because it was interesting. Um, but it's also one that you can kind of hop around and find the things that you need. Throughout, she um, says she might mention something and then she tells you the page where she goes into detail about that. That's a nice nonfiction thing, right? So we have someone who is just joyful <laughs> over compost. She talks about how like when she gets it all ready and done and it's in her wheelbarrow, she just like takes a moment and appreciates it. And I mean, that's a nice thing, right? And so I like that we're taking something that is absolutely like earthy and dirty and just saying, hey, look at this great thing you can do for your garden and for your world. Um, so compost, of course, helps us reuse yard, uh, reduce yard and food waste. And it also improves our soil health. So if you're a gardener, and I'm a gardener, um, compost is a really good thing for you to make. And so I like that this book walks us through so many things. There's many, many, many ways to compost. And she tells you about all of them. And she 100% acknowledges that not everyone is going to love it and want to put the time into it that she does. And that's okay. This is one of those things where um, you can get a little involved or, or a lot involved. And she's going to show you what to do regardless. So I think that's really, really nice. I also like that there's lots of DIYs in here. So she tells you, you can of course buy these things, but also she walks you through step by step building your own. And so that's another really nice element of this. Um, I like how conversational it is. I like how informative it is. I like that she really spans all skill levels and just that it can be a fun thing, right? And I think sometimes nonfiction seems like it is just too heavy or too much or more than you want to know. And while this absolutely tells you everything you could possibly know about compost, it's not overwhelming because really you're just gonna let some stuff rot. You're gonna let some stuff rot in your yard and maybe help it along. So if you wanna know about the science of composting plus a lot of really practical things to do and just how to get started wherever you are, uh, composting for a new generation is a really great pick. I laughed, I laughed way more than I thought I would. 